Once upon a time, in a small monastery at the foothills of the Himalayas, there lived a young monk named Tenzin. Tenzin had a deep desire to understand Buddha's teachings and attain enlightenment, but he struggled with a common problem, a cluttered mind full of thoughts and distractions. Despite his efforts to meditate, Tenzin's thoughts would wander and he found it challenging to focus. His teacher, an old monk, noticed his struggle and decided to give him a task that would help him understand the importance of emptying his mind. The old monk asked Tenzin to carry a heavy stone up the mountain and leave it at the top. Eager to learn, Tenzin agreed to the task and started his journey. As he climbed the mountain, he noticed how his mind was filled with thoughts of the stone's weight, his tiredness, and the steep climb ahead. Finally, Tenzin reached the top of the mountain, exhausted and drained. He placed the stone on the ground and looked around, hoping to find some sense of accomplishment. However, he still felt burdened and heavy, both physically and mentally. The old monk appeared beside Tenzin and asked him, What do you see? Tenzin replied, I see a heavy stone that I had to carry up the mountain. The old monk asked again, What else do you see? Tenzin looked around, and for the first time, he noticed the stunning beauty of the mountain and the vastness of the sky above. He saw birds flying freely and the wind rustling through the trees. In that moment, he felt a sense of peace and tranquility. The old monk smiled and said, You carried a heavy burden up the mountain, but you forgot to empty your mind. You missed the beauty that surrounded you. In order to attain true enlightenment, you must learn to empty your mind and be present in the moment. Tenzin felt a sense of realization in his heart. He realized that his mind was like the heavy stone he had carried up the mountain, and that he had been so focused on the weight of his thoughts that he had missed the beauty of the present moment. From that day on, Tenzin made a conscious effort to empty his mind and be present in the moment. He learned to let go of his worries and distractions and focus on the beauty that surrounded him. He practiced meditation every day, and slowly but surely, his mind became clearer and more focused. Years went by and Tenzin became known throughout the monastery for his wisdom and enlightenment. People came from far and wide to seek his guidance and learn from his teachings. One day, a young boy came to Tenzin and asked him, How can I empty my mind? My thoughts are always racing and I find it difficult to focus. Tenzin smiled and said, You must learn to let go of your thoughts like a leaf floating down a stream. Do not hold on to them, but let them pass by. Focus on your breath and the present moment. Be like a clear glass without any thoughts or distractions, and you will attain true enlightenment. The young boy listened to Tenzin's advice and started practicing meditation every day. He learned to let go of his thoughts and focus on the present moment, and his mind became clearer and more focused. Years later, the young boy became a wise old monk himself, known throughout the land for his teachings on emptiness and enlightenment. Just like Tenzin before him, he passed on his wisdom to a young boy who came seeking his guidance. And so, the cycle of wisdom and enlightenment continued as each generation learned the importance of emptying their minds and being present in the moment. The moral of the story is clear. To attain true enlightenment, one must learn to empty their mind of distractions and focus on the present moment. Tenzin's story shows us that we can let go of our worries and distractions and find peace and tranquility in the beauty that surrounds us. Through practice and dedication, we can learn to empty our minds and attain true enlightenment, just like the wise old monks before us. It takes patience and perseverance, but with time, we can achieve a clearer and more focused mind. Furthermore, the story of Tenzin shows us that enlightenment is not an end point, it is a continuous journey. As we progress on this journey, we must also pass on our wisdom to others, just like Tenzin and the young boy before him. We must continue to learn and grow, passing on our knowledge to future generations, ensuring that the cycle of wisdom and enlightenment continues. In today's fast-paced world, where we are constantly bombarded with distractions and worries, it is easy to get lost in our thoughts and forget to appreciate the beauty around us. But through the story of Tenzin, we are reminded that if we take the time to empty our minds and be present in the moment, we can find peace and tranquility even in the midst of chaos. So let us take a moment to empty our minds to let go of our worries and distractions, and to focus on the beauty that surrounds us. Let us be like Tenzin and the wise old monks before us, 
passing on our wisdom and guiding others on their journey towards enlightenment.